Here's a question I got for you guys. So Reigns did his acknowledge me bit before the match. God, was that entrance long. Mm -hmm. And especially on a show that was already in its fourth hour. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But do you think if, let's say they're doing Reigns and Rock at Mania, there's going to be a, like a substantial part of the crowd that's cheering Roman Reigns in that match, don't you think? Oh, yeah. I mean, because there already is. I mean, like, I mean, that thing, like that whole acknowledge me thing. I mean, I guess it's supposed to, but it gets a baby face rate just because how unbeatable he's booked. I mean, it's only natural that people are just going to cheer him. I think it'll be pretty 50 50, but there'll be a lot of people cheering him. Yeah. Yeah. But, but people but, are going to be pumped to see Rock back wrestling. Uh, absolutely. But it's not going to be like 100 to zero. I mean, I, I think. No, and, no, 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 and, no. Yeah. And, and we were talking about this, Justin, earlier in the show, might have been during Becky Bianca. That w, modern WWE, it's not so much about face heel alive anymore. It's just about getting two big names in and letting the crowd cheer for who the fuck they want to cheer for. It mm-hmm. seems. Yeah, we've talked about it before as far as where they're going to go for WrestleMania. And I believe Ryan's with me here that I would love to see Roman Reigns versus The Rock at WrestleMania. I, I think that is a main event, obviously. But I don't think it needs to be for the title. I, I think somebody else needs to want needs to be the one to get the rub, the shine from beating Roman Reigns. And that's honestly part of the reason why I enjoyed this so much, this match so much, was that I was very invested in Brock and Theory for that matter, not winning. Because I just think that would have been a waste from you know what you've been building for two years here with Roman Reigns. Mm-hmm. Like, you know. Lesnar got the undefeated streak from Undertaker. He doesn't need this. I, this time they have got to give it to somebody who can use it for years to come. Um, and just real quick, I want to say the, the, the tractor Gaga stuff was really fun. The only lame spot was when Brock dumped Roman into the ring just because the tractor wasn't up high enough. I think it could have been effective if it was higher up. Yeah. Sorry, just a little side note there. No, no, I, yeah, and I agree with that. But he, he kind of made up for it when he rolled out, I think. Um, it, so if it's not a – I mean, it's interesting when you are looking way into the future at our crystal balls with, like, Mania. Because if Roman's still the unified champion, that means he will defend against the Rumble winner at WrestleMania, right? Yeah. Unless if they break protocol. And, I mean, if that and if it's Rock, then Rock's got to win the Rumble, too. Right. Ugh. That, I mean, that's something else to consider. I mean, I know a lot of people think that, you, and I know what you, it's on the tip of your tongue, Justin, and I assume it's on the tip of your tongue as well, well too, Ryan. But like Cody coming back and winning the Rumble is clearly a great story that they've got yep. in front of them, and you don't want to tell. You certainly don't want to have him come back for the Rumble and like lose, mm-hmm. right? That would be bad. So, I mean, that's I mean, that's interesting. And with, with not many Reigns title offenses between now and the Rumble, people are going to think I'm crazy. And, and consider the source here. I think WWE's fine with this world title situation. They probably actually have more than enough options, believe it or not. If you only have to fill two world title matches between now and the Rumble, and you got this Cody thing and Rock, and, you know, they're going to do Rock. If they get Rock, they're, get, they're doing Rock, obviously. Mm-hmm. Um whether it's not whether or not it's for the title, I don't know. I think there's an argument to have it for the title, and there's an argument not to have it for the title. But um, yeah, I don't know. I think they've got actually enough options to fill that out. So would you have Roman lose the title before Mania? Have him and Rock be non-title? Cody win the title at Mania against somebody completely different, and then you save Cody Roman for like next summer? I. Can, can I jump in real quick? I would say yeah. you can still have Cody come back, win the Rumble, say he's not going to wait for WrestleMania, challenge Roman Reigns at whatever PLE is in between the Rumble and and WrestleMania. You have Rock cost the title for Roman Reigns to Cody, and then that you know I don't know what you do with Cody at WrestleMania. Yeah, that's the only problem. Yeah, mm-hmm. Because part of me thought that they might split the titles. Mm-hmm. Like that, like in, in my head, like when they were no, like I don't think I don't think they should, but I could see the argument to do it in the sense that you could then serve all the masters we're talking about. You could still have Ro- like Roman and Rock be a title match, and then Cody would win the Rumble and challenge whomever else. Like I, Cody beating Brock for the title would not have been a terrible idea. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 
I mean, I, I don't, I, I think that is key though. If, if, if Cody's, if Roman's working rock, who does Cody work at mania? You know, I don't want to see Seth Rollins again, please. Dear God, no. I mean, it, there's there's no way we see The Rock winning the world title, right? Because I just... No, at his, no, 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 no. Yeah, okay, okay. I just... At his age and, you know, how much he works and how valuable he is in Hollywood, I, I can't see him doing more than just one and, match. And to your earlier point that you made, Justin, very astutely about why Brock shouldn't have won here, I think that goes like double, triple for Rock. I mean, the mm-hmm. last person who should end Roman Reigns' long title one is, is Dwayne Johnson. Yeah. Like the absolute last. Right. I mean, maybe...